How's it going everybody? This is Fastlane Fixer and today I'm going to be working on the Yerf Dog. Not quite sure what all I'm going to be doing today but I know I want to get the engine mounted better as you can see it rocks back and forth and I want to check the air filter and everything. First off I guess let's open up the air box and see how it looks in there. So it doesn't have an air filter, it's just, well, just empty. I'm going to go ahead and blow out all the spider webs and stuff in there. There we go. I guess I'm just going to put it back together for now. Okay guys. I think I'm going to go ahead and take off the engine to get a better look at it and take some of this off, see if I can get it off. Got the spark plug out. Looks brand new. Doesn't even look like it's been fired once. I went ahead and did all the wiring, put whatever looked like it went together together, and so I hope it's good enough. So let's go ahead and I just put the jumper cables from that to forklift battery. Because I don't have a battery for, for it right now. And that's the battery that doesn't hold a charge. So let's just, I guess let's see if it turns over. There you go. Sweet. First, I think I'm going to zip tie all this up, make it look a lot neater. Now I guess I just need to get the gas tank on and see if it'll fire up. There we go, got the gas tank on, got it all hooked up. Now I just need to get some gas, which I don't have any two-stroke gas ready. I noticed the exhaust, it's only bolted on in one place and it's going to, it's really bad for the engine. So I'm going to see if I can find some bolts and put it right up there. And when you're dealing with the exhaust, always want to have a lock washer so that it won't vibrate off. There we go. Shouldn't be loose now. Oh yeah, much better. Okay, I just remembered that this actually goes right there to tighten up the chain better. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that on too.
There we go. Got it done. Pretty nice and solid and it keeps the chain tight. Okay, I'm just gonna use some of the starting fluid just to see if it'll fire up. I don't I still don't have any gas, but I just wanna see if it fires and everything. Wonder if it's getting spark. I'm gonna pull the spark plug out. Oh, you want to test for spark? Yeah. I didn't see anything. You might need a new coil. Uh, yeah, because that's a brand new spark plug. This. Yeah, you probably need a new coil. I guess that's what that is. Yeah, it is. I wonder if you're even getting sparked to here. Let's let's put a tester on this, see if we're getting sparked to here. All right, now turn the key. You ready? Yeah. Not even getting power to this. Okay, so we're pretty sure that this thing is just not working right. So I'm gonna have to go ahead and see if I can search around on the web and try to find one. Well, guys, I think that's everything that I can actually do on it right now. So I think that's gonna have to be the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe, I greatly appreciate it, and I'll see you next time.